What up, everybody? It's Joe from Complex. We're somewhere in Atlanta at Little Yachty's house. Going to get an exclusive look at his sneaker closet, his toy collection, and everything in between. Let's go. So, Yachty, we're in tight quarters, but we're surrounded by a lot of OG. Some sneakers, real heat. Some sneakers I couldn't even find yeah, on Google. Exactly. I'm going to hop out. I want you to take us through okay. this organized Y'all don't understand mess. how excited I am. I really wanted to do this because I've really been having this on my chest and needing to show the world. I love it. I'm going to yeah. leave it to this guy and pop out. Yachty, right. you talked about OG ones on sneaker shopping. Yeah. The Royals. We'll start. Actual price tag, $79 finish line. OG price tag on the box with the laminated retro card. The one, you know what I'm saying? I got three different years. And you and the crazy shit, I did this with my homies. You can compare the different blues and the different leathers. Like it's three different like materials on the check. 94 red ones, pristine condition. They've never been worn. Look at that bottom, I lick it, but it's weird. Like, doesn't even have the year on the sides, it has the year on the box. Yeah, can we please get this just in case they think I'm lying to them? 1994. They have about three pairs of red ones. Crazy, my oldest pair looks like the newest pair. Only pair I need now is uh, band ones just so I can throw them up there with the X on the back, because that's that just looks fire. So I know I did sneaker shopping, Joe, and I and it was and it was a pair of ones that I could not get, I didn't have. What are you looking for that you haven't been able to looking get? Looking for fragment ones, man. Yeah, I need those too. But it's, it's been a minute since I've seen you. Stay right here, my bad, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm all over the place with the swag. We're here, and I got two pairs, actually. I don't want to show the other pairs, they on ice. I also got the cheap pairs. The gluten-free ones? <laughs> <laughs> the gluten-free fragment ones, you know what I'm saying? The nagment ones. And then Yachty, over your right shoulder, the black cement threes with the Nike Air on the back. Oh, you jumping straight heat. Okay, I got you, I feel you. Let me put this, let me put this fire down, you know what I'm saying? I don't wanna burn my house down. Uh -huh. With the perfect discoloring. This is my, I think this is my favorite box. Yes. Not the 2018 one. Are they 20? Got a card. We have the cards. You know what I'm saying? We have the cards are halved. Yeah, we got the receipts. This is 2001, bro. I'm actually scared to. I don't even know if I can wear these. Like, I don't know how well that'll be like on ripping, but it doesn't matter. We have them. How much do you think I paid for these, Joe? 15. A whopping $200. I, I, I came up. Wow. I walked in one day and got blessed by God. I want to jump back over here real okay, quick, Joe. Go for it. Just to show. Yeah, the ones we talked about. Exactly, I want to show them. Call them the that way ones. But honestly, they're same ones, you know what I'm saying? Bootleg ones from like the 80s. They were actually fakes. But I saw them and thought they were like the dopest shoe ever. You know what I'm saying? I paid like $1,000 for these. Extremely rare. For fake shoes. I've never seen anybody with these though. Mm -mm. Like these are extremely, extremely, extremely rare. It wouldn't be right unless I, should, I paid my respect to the man, the legend, the king, Virgil, man. Air bolts. And you got the Prestos. Yeah. I got the whole collection. These are amazing. These are so dope that these are the only ones that face you. Two, three pair of ones, but I like to have the ones out that he signed. All the other ones are in timeout. Off-white blazers, off-white Air Maxes. These were oh. super dope too. I don't who. Remember dunks, yep. I don't know how to play basketball. Oh, as y'all know, complex kind of dunk, whatever. Blow me. Anyways, this shoe's super dope. One, one of my favorite ones he did. The complex cons. Still looking for the moments. It's, it's all good though. I have them before the next time you blink. Don't trip. Oh, I forgot about these, bro. These, 
Man, these are forces. These forces are like unlike forces I've ever seen before. Yada, you're talking about how good Virgil did on this collection. Yeah. How do you feel about him going to Louis Vuitton? I'm super excited, bro. I already love Louis Vuitton, so now that Virgil's going there, I'm just gonna like love it 10 times more. Yadi, I'm seeing the LV Dons though. Yeah. Yeah, uh, you see, you had to have brought a fire extinguisher because you just, you jumped straight into heat. I like it. I, I like it. Joe, I like what you're doing, but okay, let's do it. You see the original brown Louis Vuitton box. It's not orange, like the new Louis Vuitton. <sighs> Jaspers. I want you to see this bottom. I can lick it. You know what I'm saying? But then this would be R rated. This is the most beautiful, ugly shoe I've ever seen in my life. You know what I'm saying? I, I paid uh, $5,000 for these dead stock, which actually I felt like was actually a pretty good deal. I have about four or five pairs of infrareds. My first pair from high school, <laughs> call these the Pebble Brook Sixers. As a high school, I went through Pepper Brook. Are those the see, AT ATF days? Man, yes. When you shouted them out, so many comments were really applauding that yeah. you shouted AT ATF man, out. Yeah, ATF is amazing, bro. That was my childhood. I, I'm pretty sure I got these off AT ATF. Look at the yellowing. There's not a lick of suede on this shoe. All the suede is torn off. Man, these are fucking biggity beat, man. But I used to wear them every day. They looked like this in high school. Like they haven't changed the look. They look the exact same. I should have put him over here with his best friends with um, Kanye and Virgil. It's really disrespectful for me to like separate him from his friends. These are so pretty. Oh my God, that blueberry yum yum. Two pair really be pure money fours. Now I know, I know what you're thinking. I know you're like, oh, Lil Yachty, your pure money fours look like bullshit. Oh, they're so beat. Hold on, because you're judging me for no reason. All right, now check this out. Now you see this white box, okay. Boom, bitch. Got a brand new pair on your bitch ass, okay? With the brush, with my name on it, and some Jason Mark cleaning shoe repair. Ooh, and some other Jordans that no one would ever wear. But who gives a fuck? Because Jordan sent this to me. That means I fucking matter. So fuck you, you know what I'm saying? These will never be worn, by the way. I've never ever wore these in my life. This will stay in this really cool packaging. Okay. These. Very rare sneakers we're about to go into right now. I don't, they're not even like a certain sneaker, they are their own sneaker, like collector sneakers. First pair, I've seen Joe's really hype about these. Boom. Air Seinfelds. Crazy. What the figgity fuck? I think, I, I think my episode is gonna have the most cuss words ever used because I'm just so excited to show you guys my fucking swag. How'd you get those? I bought these from round two. These were only released to the staff, to the crew. The shoe is called Air Seinfeld. Yeah. That's insane. Look, you know what I'm saying? If you look at the label, promo, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, for promotion, 1993. These shoes are four years older than me. What the, oh, look at the tips. Look at the, the, the t I never noticed this. The tip is like, this is super dope. The shoe tip. You can't go, you can't even Google these. So, so rare. Another pair of shoes, promotion, that you cannot Google. These, do, right. these literally do not exist online. These do not exist online. Scrubs. 100th edition Scrubs. 100th episode, they got a shoe for it. It's like a tennis blazer almost. These are so rare, you cannot find these online. And this stuff isn't cheap either, you know what I'm saying? So some of this stuff had been sitting there for like maybe years. No one ever like either wanted it, thought it was any cool, or like, I thought it was cool because I won like Seinfeld and Scrubs. I think this is one of my favorite sneakers. Oof. The original pair though, this is not the complex pair. Wow. You have to say, I have real OGs, you know what I'm saying? Double, double check. That's how you can tell. Original Rockefeller pair, you know, because they came out complex time. One check. Dead stock, never before worn. These are crazy. I think the new one has a blue Rockefeller, mm -hmm. if I'm not tripping. This is oh, great. It's like a navy blue, yeah. Yeah, yeah navy blue. This is great. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. All right. Boom! 
on. Playstations. PlayStation Air Forces, man. It took me a long time, bro. Like seriously, I think I got them for a thousand. These are these actually says promo. Wait, did these not, these came out right? This shoe definitely came out. Very rare though. Like super, yeah, yeah, no yeah. one has. No, it says yeah. 67 out of 150. Where? Right here on the inside. Man, I wish I had 69. <laughs> There's a lot of fake PlayStations. Who am I to judge anybody? But mine's are very real. Oh, DMPs. I was working at the finish line when those came out. Really? Yep. Sixes and elevens, right? Yep. Yeah. Elevens. Like, these are so hard. I like those better than the Con Concords. You know what I'm saying? Those are dope. These, man. Ugh. It's between these and infrareds on my favorite six. These are amazing. I still never, I really haven't seen anybody wear these like that. And I need y'all to show my heat. Don't cut out my heat. We don't need to cut out my heat. I don't even know how the fuck you put this back in. I want to talk about this for a second. My friend Macklemore, he actually showed me a while, it was like last year. He had a prototype, he had a green six. It was kind of like this. And, and you know, he really, he felt like they stole his idea. It's really funny. But I, actually, I'm with him. I believe they probably did, you know, because it never came out. But he actually has a six that I've been supposed to have for he the gave longest. Me I know, I saw, I know. I just talked to him, I talked to him last night or night before last. He's like, man, I still got your size 11, man. I just need to see you. So, man, just hold him till I come to Seattle. Shouts out to Macklemore, man. Real quick, I forgot to show you guys Shadow Ones. And I have a new pair of Shadow Ones up there. The material is just so, like, it's so drastically different, it's insane. So it's, first off, they used elephant skin on the gray. It's a, sm it's a smoother leather here. It's a darker gray, a cooler gray on this shoe. It's the same shoe, these are both shadow ones. Champs, me up with this med box for the flu games. They did a real cool packaging. I already went, I ran through it so it's not cool anymore, but it came with a Beats pill, get it? Cause like a pill, like it's flu game, like a towel, like a water bottle, like all this stuff for a mid kit for like if you were like sick, like cause these are the flu games. I thought that was so creative. These are very rare, bro. This, this packaging, it's crazy, man. That stuff matters to me. Woo! Yes, sir. 577 of 1,734. These are super clean. This is a grown man shoe to me. Like this, what you wear when you're like, like 32, you know, your stepdad, you have two step kids that you don't really like, but you're going out with them. That's, that's what this is. So, we've seen one side of my closet. Now it's time to go to the other side. 